Hey, what is going on, Karasuno family? My name is Mike, and welcome back to another Karasuno TV episode. Guys, today I'm bringing you God of High School episode 9. Uh, I missed this one. Unfortunately, I was on vacation uh, just this past week. So, uh, you know, God of High School airs on Monday. I was gone. So I wanted to save this for the weekend when I got back. And that's what I'm doing now. I'm, I'm pushing through my weeklies that I missed out on. Uh, ReZero, Fire Force, there's a couple. Uh, and it was unfortunate because I know that this was a week of great episodes. Uh, just watch ReZero's. The jaw is still hitting the floor. Um, I'm, I'm going to be moving through them, though. Uh, ReZero was, was first, like I said. Got of high school now. Then uh, Fire Force and Black Clover. Uh uh, just got done with the Black Clover opening reaction, uploaded that, so uh, check that out. Uh, and be sure to subscribe while you're at it too. Guys, I have a lot of great content on the channel that you guys will like, so please you know, go check it out, subscribe. Uh, socials are in the description, all that good stuff. So um, let's get into this one. Uh, it's gonna be God of High School episode nine. I heard a lot of good things though. Uh, you know, I tried to keep myself as spoiler free as possible. I stayed away from uh, you know, all the reactions everything about it you know I, I you know i did see you know a couple screenshots and stuff like that Every, everyone likes to you know screenshot the the cool animated scenes and everything like that so uh but i'd say 99 percent um unfiltered raw you know unspoiled reaction you're gonna you're gonna get right here so it's a little bit late but let's hop into it guys this is god of high school episode nine curse slash cornered let's fly crows Right, 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 right. So I, I was forgetting a little bit where we are. The Jin Mori's grandfather, Jin Tae Jin, was captured, right? And I think Mori just found out. I don't remember. It's been like a, over a week and a half now. Um, but he was captured. I think Mori just found out. Yeah, yeah, it was his birthday, everything like that. They got past the first round of the national tournament. Maybe second round now? I want to see some good fights though, but Mori is weak, right? Yep, yep, he, he got that picture. And I knew it, guys. You know, I mean, it's like if you know Mori's character up until now, you know that he was going to hop, like, leap at that opportunity or, you know, at the chance to go get his grandfather back. Oh, okay, so we're going back into the tournament. But, you know, we, we just saw before the opening played that Mori was on his way to go get his grandfather. Hmm. I wonder if he makes it back. I, I'm going to say he doesn't make it back. And, you know, they start with the disqualification. And he, for, he forfeits, you know, the round. So now Dawe and Mira both have to win. Yep, that's exactly what's going to happen. Is she gonna is she gonna let them know? No. Maybe she No, she knows. She probably knows, right? Oh, Dawei's suspended. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Right, I forgot he was suspended, so he was basically their their defector, right? They needed to 2-0 because he counts as an immediate loss. <laughs> yeah, draw draw out the match. I'll tell you what, the, the announcer having the same voice actor kills me every time. Even though, you know, the original one died. Why are they hooded, too? Why do they got these, like, capes on? Yeah, right? He, he throws the cloak off. <laughs> Look at this guy. He's shredded wearing the, the little banana hammock. Oh, he's a swimmer, too. That's funny, he's got the goggles on. I, I swam in uh, high school and college as well. Funny. That could have been me, guys. <laughs> oh, okay, so Mori's already at this uh, this warehouse. I guess, you know, 
depending on how the times align, there's a chance. Does he see the grandfather? No. Yeah. Oh, there he is laying on the ground. Oh my gosh, look at this guy's cheeks. Okay, Mira's... Mira's doing work now. Oh, now countered, right? Oh my gosh. He's creepy as hell. I... You know, he's blushing and everything. What? Somebody throwing something from outside the ring? Oh, okay. Just toss him a weapon. I thought I thought somebody else was getting involved. Was that her? Is that her old uh, sword, right? Because she lost that, right? She lost that in the beginning. No? Yeah, she did. Oh, Lord. Transformed. Or it looks like something, you know, a sort of shell. He manifested a shell on the outside of the sword. Oh, this is the old guy, right? Who is this? That voice. I mean, she's doing a good job at dodging, though. You know, he's got this huge broadsword. Nice, nice. The swordless moves are always cool. Oh, she's mixing in some, some kicks, too. Nice. I, I like this. Ooh, did you see that impact? Did you, did you guys see those impact frames there? And she retrieves the sword. What? Nice. Wow, that like palm. When when she, when she did that that style one, those impact frames were phenomenal. What I just missed? The sword just teleported. Well, excuse me. The sword just teleported back into the owner's hand. Okay, so, and we're cutting back and forth, too. I, I, I do like this. Mi this is probably Mira's best fight to date. Oh, this isn't... This, this isn't the grandfather. Is that a bomb? Yep. Let's hope he got out of there. Oh, my lord. Well, I guess not. There goes the main character, guys. Show's over. Jeez. Who's this guy? One of those... One of he looks... He's dressed like one of the commissioners from the tournament. Right? Uh, that's not my favorite. A little blurry. But do is this does this imply that the grandfather's okay now? Ooh, Mori's getting up. Doppelganger is that his name? Doppelganger? I mean, you know, you know, clearly he made a clone of uh, Jin Taijin. Oh, this was another... Yeah, he's another worshipper of this sh of this church then. Okay, so the, you know, this is a two this is a two and one bout here. They're taking out members of the church and winning the tournament if she can. Oh, she's from Shark Boys team. What kind of move is that? That's not fair. Takes the head and puts him right in her chest. Haha, <laughs> nice. What did he do? Did he just block? I thought he just blocked. He didn't fight back, did he? He didn't punch back? Was she just shocked and dropped to the ground?
Oh gosh. Oh, she's about to kick now too. Uh, I so I thought this was like you know, Knox. But she was just engaging the other team ahead of time. Man, Shark Boy's strong. That's all I know. Oh, cool. Another Mori fight. Cool. Okay. This looks pretty good. They did a pretty good job here. You know, there's a lot of movement going on on screen, a lot of bodies, and they did a pretty good job there animating that. Okay, good. Some more. <laughs> Look at all these bodies. That just looks funny, guys. Oh, it seems like they've fallen lower into the warehouse. Why are they all grinning and smiling, too? Oh my gosh! That's the guy they're fighting, right? So what's going on? Oh, so the, these are the real members? So th so that's one of his doppelgangers then? Oh, so really he's just fighting... Really, they're fighting all, all doppelgangers. Mm. Oh! Dude, things are moving too quick right now. What's going on? Oh, he's hitting the pressure point. Is he actually going to do it? <laughs> no pain? Well, Mira's doing a good job holding out here, guys. She knows something's up now. Yeah, look at him smiling. I, why is it, does his doppelgangers love smiling? Ooh, again, again, you know, impact frames looking good. The initial frames when she takes off from that sprint, that's all looking really good. That has a lot, you know, a lot of style, a lot of weight to all the different blows. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So she, why is she, she stiff as a board there? <laughs> what? <laughs> they, they, they flash to the wedding. Mira's vowing to surpass Dawei and Mori. That's a you know a tough task. <laughs> The deep voice coming out of her mouth, out of her body is too, it's, it's too funny. What's she doing now? Oh, cool. What is this? Flashback? Well, it's like a pillar. Oh, there goes the sword. Does she have it now? She does. She, did she just summon the sword back? No, she got some, oh. The Chakiria! Lu Bu! <laughs> oh, she made a contract and she sort of saw. Oh, he's got one too, Kraken! Oh, Lord! So she awakened her, her power! <laughs> Number 42? Oh, gosh! Strong finishing move! This guy's got no chance. I wonder if it makes him weaker now, too, because she took out a decoy. But Mira wins. But where's... Where's Jin Mori? Insane Awakening. I like how they saw into the past. You know, sort of the... The, the historical... The, or the, you know, the backstory of... Oh, that's Mori! He's here? 
now, now, how long did uh? How long has it been since he activated his pressure points? And what happened? How did he get out of there? Chakarik, 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 Chakarik. I gotta keep saying it. It's not, you know, it's very foreign to me. So, I, you know, saying it's gonna help me out. Chakarik, Chakarik. I've gotten pretty decent with the Japanese words, but, you know, now that we're getting Korean thrown in. Oh, he's pissed. Oh, this is, they aren't even coming close. They look like. These projectiles look like they're in slow motion. Oh, cool. He's got like a. a, a woo! Was that the triple kick? <laughs> Goodness gracious, Mori. Well, we got the rough animation, though. Oh, I love this side by side. This is really good. Original. This isn't the Chakarik, right? The blue dragon kick. This is his. This is his. Uh, you know, like he said, this is his original move. This isn't even the Chakarik. Ooh, blew a hole in the side of the warehouse and the ring. Love the side by side. <laughs> oh, this guy's pissed. How does he have any energy left? Original two? What is this, two dragon? Double dragon? Twin blue dragon kick. And you hear that scream? <laughs> oh, this guy's got no shot, right? Oh, <laughs> Who's watching? Who are all these? Ooh, the tiger raised another tiger. Oh, those are now those are screenshot worthy guys. Ooh, okay. All right, let's talk after the ending. Okay, that's it, guys. Uh, no after credits, no preview, no nothing. Uh, so those last two. Uh, those last two shots of Mori and his grandfather, you know, the, the really nicely animated ones, sort of black and white going on. Those are the ones that I had seen on Twitter, you know, prior to watching this episode. Uh, I thought they would be, you know, a little bit more significant. Not really. They were just thrown in at the end. So I, I thought that, you know, Jin Taejin would have had a bigger part in this episode, but he didn't. Um, that was the episode. I enjoyed it a lot. I thought that this was probably Mira's best episode. I think she got, you know, a lot of focus and the focus that was given to her was good. Uh, it was a good fight. Uh, I, I think that the climax of the fight was just, oh, it was okay. It was very cool. Grand scale, like a lot of, sh a lot of awe, you know, uh, but I think that it was probably the worst animated part of the fight. Uh, Mori got, you know, a lot of love here as well especially towards the end of the episode his the animation of his fight uh looked good you know both of his fights the side by side uh, it was you know a cool style choice that they decided to make uh going with that um you know it cost it ended up actually you know now that i think about it it probably didn't cost them too much in the terms of you know resources for drawing both sides because they were you know the thing they were going for was that you know it was mirrored both fights so, like I said, Mori got a lot of love here. Mira got love too. I think that this was one of the better episodes simply because they kept the dialogue, you know, not as involved. I think that that's one of the weakest parts of the show. And, you know, this being a stronger episode, I believe, was, you know, very fight centric, a lot of action. And I think that's what this show does the best. So, Looking forward to the weeks ahead, um, towards the end of the season. I don't, I don't know where they're going to go. I thought that this, you know, the grandfather, the whole plot, like, you know, finding the grandfather would go on a little bit longer. I guess it is going to drag on, you know, well, not drag on, but it's going to, you know, go on a bit further because he didn't actually find his grandfather or we don't know because Maury, you know, after he 
fights doppelganger at the warehouse goes right to the arena and fights doppelganger in the arena in the tournament um that's probably what's going to round out this season though you know the grandfather plot uh, I, I can't see what else you know how much more they're going to build up and you know get done in this season with with Knox. Um, and then the tournament, I don't know how far the tournament's going to get either. It seems like, you know, we're another round in. It's probably, you know, I would like to say that, you know, Maury's team, the main characters fight Shark Boy's team, but I don't think we're even going to, you know, we might see that, we might not, but, you know, judging on the opening, Maury's definitely going to fight the, um, I don't remember his name now, but, you know, his, Maury's grandfather, uh, the, the kid that he, he gave the the notebook to uh, the one who I don't, I don't I don't even I don't can't remember any distinct characteristics about this guy. So, uh, but he I, I think that Moore's gonna the, the, their team's gonna fight that team. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, good episode. I, I think that you know God of High School has room for improvement. I think that like I said, the best parts of it are the fights, and I think that that's you know the bread and butter of the, the bread and butter of the show and you know, what's going to make or break the show. So thank you guys so much for watching. Seriously, seriously. Thank you. Uh, next week, like I said, the weeklies will return to their normal schedule. So God of High School will be coming at you guys on Monday, uh, when it airs 10 30 on Crunchyroll, uh, EST of course. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. You know, if you like this episode, uh, if you like my content, please check the channel, check the description box for the, uh, socials, you know, hit that subscribe button guys. It really helps me out a lot. And thank you again for watching. Seriously. Uh, Karasuna family, you mean so much to me and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.